episode. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Thought I hit the button. I'm trying to do. Okay, now we're good. I thought I hit the live button. Freaking pain in the ass. Anyway, what's up, everybody? Welcome to a very uh, unique edition of No Bucks Given, uh, as we're going to be combining this with some HD dub uh, gameplay because why not at this point? Uh, I got their usual crew with me. Uh, we got uh, Basement Heather and Jay Pizzle. How you guys doing this evening? I am sore as Same. all need hell, man. Why would you oh, do? From Bullen? Oh my god. I use yeah. muscles. I think I used muscles that I haven't used in like. Bully is one of those things years. where it's such an a, a movement that you'll only ever do playing fucking yeah, bowling. That, it, yeah. Once I got going though, when I was bowling, I actually got. I she she she's gonna be better than me. I think. She, it's kind of like uh, baseball. I'd say. It's for the same her, movement. once she got in the flow of it, it was like watching her ride a bike again. It was really, it was actually quite beautiful, you know. And, and it was, it was, I enjoyed watching her ball. What's up, Alpha and Federico? Joining us in the Chizad. How you guys doing? Uh, this is uh, going to be just, you know, random straight. I think we have, do we have a couple topics you guys want to talk about? Yeah. We'll just throw some matches yeah. up there, too. Yeah. By the way, uh, for anybody who gives it, whoever, by, by the way, whoever gives a fucking rat's ass, um, the thumbnail. I literally went to YouTube random thumbnail generator. I was about com. to say, like, what is the, <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> I literally had no idea what to do, so For I literally meaning, went I'm to. Like, oh, he, I'm like, oh, he's he's outsmarted me this time, and I looked. Nope. <laughs> I still don't understand. Nope. The fucking no. little wallet in the hand. No, he's outsmarted me this time. <laughs> he, never gonna happen. <laughs> it's like it's like me at like a fucking art museum. Like, I don't understand any of what this is, but I'm sure it has a deeper meaning. This is pain or something. I have no fucking clue what it is. I literally just typed in, like, YouTube random thumbnail generator. That, like, I got three. Um, one of them was really fucking, like, racist. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm not doing that. Shocking. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not doing that. I wonder why. It was, it was like a black. It was like a bla <laughs> Don't look at my thumbnail. Don't look at my, don't look at my profile picture on Discord. Uh, um, uh, it was... I think it was like a black ghetto version of Stewie from Family Guy. It was very, like, it was very racist. See that image floating around. And I'm like, I don't think that would be good for a thumbnail. Then it's I called an urban image. And then the, the other one was like a random, like, it was almost like a weather report of like a weird hurricane traffic pattern. I'm like, that makes even less sense. So believe it or not, folks, this thumbnail actually fits the most out of the first three I got. I'm going to tell you right now, Connor. There are actual people trying to become weather people on YouTube. Oh, that's te that's that's tempting to watch. That's tempting. Yeah, that's dude. tempting to watch them crash and burn. There's a big motherfucking storm. <laughs> you <laughs> need <laughs> to watch them. Oh my god, how much fun you would have with that? Why? Because there's a Canadian low followed by a Mexican high. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna be wetter than my wife's pussy. <laughs> It's, Come 30, Friday. It's, it's 32 degrees at the airport, which is <laughs> stupid because I don't know anybody who lives at the airport. <laughs> George Carlin was so great. Uh, that, oh, to, um, weatherman was tonight's just, forecast, yeah. dark. Continue, continue dark continue in the morning dark. with patterns of sunrise throughout the day. All right. Uh, what should we do for matches? Let's throw a match up here. Well, chair. Yeah. Yeah, that's what are the match types again in this fucking game? There's a lot of match types in this one. So I was I've been I, ambulance casket, all your regular matches. Let's see. So we got uh obviously we got the one on ones, the two on twos, threes, do four. A gauntlet match for one of the titles that one of us just do, a, holds. Just do a just do a fucking thirty man gauntlet match. Only Jesus. Right, I'm trying to remember which one's which. So I know gauntlet's just one on one. Uh, until eliminator one remains. Is Elim what you want. eliminator is two okay, this was like this is like the, the Royal Rumble. Yeah. And then this one is 1v all. So we don't want that one. one we don't want... and, and so early. It's an eliminator. 30 men. Jesus. For the e, the HGW championship. And we'll be here until 4 a.m. watching. God damn it. All right. Uh, uh, not me. I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Let's do the fucking clash. No, hold on. Do we have any? Jump around. Jump, jump. Should we do jump. it at Walmart? Yeah. Yes, Walmart. Yeah, let's do no, it. no, Walmart's broken. Oh yeah, that's Walmart right. Shit, hold on. Um, just do a re regular. Yeah, we'll just do a regular power HGW power arena. arena. I love how I put a question mark on it. <laughs> All right, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I believe Cody is the champion. 
Let me just make yes. sure. Let me just make sure of that. Really, um, Alpha? You've seen all these weather-based channels? I have yet to see anything remotely close to that shit. The weather-based channel showing up on what YouTube or? Yeah, I haven't, see, I haven't seen any on of YouTube. that. YouTube. YouTube. What YouTube. The fuck? Like, why would you go? Like, wait, who the fuck? Fucking everybody oh, has wait access a to the weather app. It's on installed on every phone. Hold on. Yeah, but they, but but you don't get the personalities to go with it. Son of a bitch, I backed out of the menu too but fast. Yeah, I don't want the personalities. I just want the fucking weather. Too bad. <laughs> gonna be, it's gonna be like it's gonna be like uh, schizophrenia. Too bad you're getting the personalities. All right, let me no. give me one second. I thought Cody was the champ, but I think I think JP might actually be the champion if I'm not mistaken. I am not, I am not the champion. I think Cody lost it. Really. Oh, no, you are wrong, JP Baker. Why? You are the HDW He's champion. Not He's not You're the what? Champ. You're watching the HD. You are the HDW champion. How in the fuck did that happen? You won the last time we did this, and I think it was. I oh, because I didn't see it. It was a gauntlet like match. He cheated. No, no, he, it was, no he didn't. He didn't cheat. It was a gauntlet match. He came in later. Listen, he used to be my tag team partner. Cheated on me all the time. Who the fuck is this? Oh. Fuck me. <laughs> okay, this is... This... <laughs> oh, it's me. <laughs> oh, fuck me, all right. Um, I... I... I wasn't there for that. I... I... Where were you? <laughs> when JP Baker no, I know, I, I know you weren't there, JP, but... Uh, no, I don't remember me being there. Yeah, you, you, you weren't. I know you, I know you weren't. Because right. I would have been talking shit if I did. All right, so we're going to have you enter in at though. random, and it's going to okay, be... Okay, and that's fine. All it's right. going to be to me, your former tag team partner. We want I to... used to be slash lover. Here we go. This yeah, is what I want. Well, okay. The things we See, did in the bedroom. Where, oh my this, God. This is where you take everything where it doesn't need to go. <laughs> well, where it's been. At no point was I ever, nor have I ever thought about being your lover, all right? That's a well, lie. Well, not what you said when I was eight inches in you. <laughs> never that was three inches ago. <laughs> Eight inches ago. <laughs> this is my fantasy. <laughs> oh Jesus! All right, let's add some fucking freaks in this thing. All right, let's see. I I love Bork Laser. I just I love that with the fucking paper bag. It's just it. Whoever did that, fucking kudos. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see here. Bum chuck it. <laughs> it's fucking disgusting. Uh, <laughs> is he is wrong. <laughs> Uh, no, let's not do Deadpool. Uh, Dick Cheney, yeah. Let's... Isn't this game like fuck with you if they have multiple attires? It, 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 in this, in this, in this instance. It. You know what? I might actually want to watch the fucking. I'd probably rather watch the fucking news, the, the fucking dumb shits do weather on fucking YouTube than watch the actual. Than news. watch the fucking actual weather because they'll be still fucking. The Grover's make gonna go over. About they'll make political fucking comments. Oh yeah, Himmelfarb. <laughs> Forgot Himmelfarb was in here. Mm -hmm. It's going to be bad for all of God, us so with the storm rolling in, Jesus. just like if Trump became president. Mm -hmm. So many goddamn John Cena. <laughs> so stupid. -ass oh, shit. I forgot to mention. I forgot to mention to you guys. I did. In, I did download a male and female local talent, and I put them on both brands for universe mode. Okay. So that way, if you, I put in. I put in two local talents. I put Gosh, like a. Gotcha. Yeah, I basically put like a low card um, local talent male and a low card uh, uh, female. That way, if you want to do you squash know, matches, you need to get fucking silence back. <laughs> yeah, perfect local talent. Fucking mime. That was funny. Muscle man. Nope. Moon Knight. Yeah, let's do Moon Knight. Let's let's get that belt back with my fucking goth attire. Oh, orange. No. Nope. Picaro. Poop stain. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know why the way his last name spelled is fucking cracking me up. That's flavor. I know he. You but know because what? Because his last name is actually Stane. They just don't have <laughs> accents Stane. over the e. Stane. It's like Mercedes Monet. I mean, she should be called Poop Stane. Steroidicus. <laughs> Jake from State Farm. Uh, come on. I gotta be done almost here right now. No, Jesus. I still have shit to unlock. Uh, na, 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 na. Oh no! No, I'll get. I I will. I eh, you know what? Fuck it. Let's leave him in there. All By right. the way, I love how you just see Dick Cheney and Casey as Raw's forehead in their pictures. Red, yeah. Just thought that was very. <laughs> <Casey is> Raw's <laughs> <laughs> what? The head. 
<laughs> just the tip. And Dora. <laughs> All right. Let's... Dora is fucking monstrous looking in this game. She's like a yeah, 90 she year old fucking geriatric cunt bag. All right. We ready to do this? <clears throat> sure. <gasps> we can do a double title match. Well, we only have. Well, we only have... Oh, I'm not putting up my title. What? It's the WTF Championship. It's up to you, basement. No. All right. Well, no. Somebody's going to win two titles then. Right. I don't like that. No. You already have no. fucking no. done that. No. Come on, fine, come fine, on, man. Fine, fine. fine. Come we'll, on, we'll put man. on the John. We'll put Joe the John Biden. Cena Legacy Championship on the line. How's that? Yeah, that's good. Okay. What the Never fuck give up. Is that? It's gonna be yours now. Never give up. Holy fucking this goddamn fucking. Holy shit. Oh my god! Look at the left. He's <laughs> fucking Casey is wrong. Is like a poster. Pretty sure that yeah. Alpha and Himmelfarb are the only two that look normal. Everybody else. Well, JP looks normal. Oh, I thought that was I thought that was Alpha. The I know that is JP. I'm sorry. Yeah. So JP. Poopstain Himmelfarb actually looks like a fucking W, like an actual WWE superstar. I look like a like fat uh, goth. The, uh, the fuck is the the guy's name? The GM of Raw or SmackDown? Oh, Nick Aldis. Nick Aldis? Nick yeah, Aldis? he kind of looks like Nick Aldis. I think he looks a little bit like Grayson Waller. Or both of them had a baby. Nick Waller. Waldis. Grayson. <laughs> <laughs> From the window <laughs> to, to the, the wall. Waldis. <laughs> 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 All right, here we go with this fucking uh, random floating goddamn Ma. ice bear in the middle of the. <laughs> oh, the the Chinese Japanese ref we smuggled in. Yep. We raised him from birth to only. He doesn't speak. This is gonna go on no forever. Language. So you guys might want to start your topics now. And by the way, I didn't mute the game just because the game can get very loud and it's hard to hear us sometimes. So apologies that uh, the game is currently. How dare you? Okay. Right. I mean, if you want to listen to. Thug, yeah. Sorry, what? Every fucking. And thing. if and there's, there's any random room. groans. Uh, I love the random groans. The unthinkable horse is back. We don't. We don't. He wants his title. So what's on your guys' mind? Okay, he just got oh, he just got out of the scissors. tank. The tank's gone. And he now has a pair of scissors. Okay, cool. Uh, shears, I guess. It's the best entrance ever. Oh, he cuts his face barber. off. He's Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Oh shit! It's Raisha. Ray Shizzle, my nizzle. <clears throat> what's up, I got We're doing pretty good. I am. I can't speak for everybody. <laughs> we're watching a uh, we're watching a thirty man gauntlet eliminator match. For not only JP's HGW championship that he currently holds, but also the prestigious John Cena Legacy Championship. Oh God, <laughs> I think it's me. Because the New World Order. I think it's me. John Cena yep. Has a legacy. <laughs> well, we know you ain't fucking winning shit. Hey, listen. It's, it's the New World. Okay, babe. God damn it! You caught on. <laughs> Can I join since JP doesn't want me anymore? No. I would like to join too. All right, fine. Wait, wait, wait. Join what? <laughs> the SmackDown? New World Order. Oh, I joined SmackDown. I'm like, oh, yeah, come on board. No, please oh, don't yeah. leave me with Trek. <laughs> <laughs> we trade. What the fuck are we talking about? Trading yeah, Basement and you. Uh, you go to, I you go to, to Raw. Join your HGW fucking it, I mean, faction, New World Order. I could care less. Uh, all right that's enough of me i'm just happy to be alive anyway go ahead there's your belt how much time i put into that 15 seconds 17 <laughs> seconds <laughs> listen if right, can, if, you said you had topics what are they give them to me oh, and there's the other belt really really the only thing that i really had well there there was something i had that too something that happened in baseball this yesterday was mm -hmm. it or friday friday yeah and then um and it has to do with celebrating home run hits and how then, dare you celebrate anything and then i want to talk about what i've seen on tv in like the last two weeks maybe well since well since since wrestling actually got really good floor is yours so I'll, Holy I'll, I'll start shit. off with that one. I've noticed that TV shows are com commercials are getting better. There isn't as much 
of the they still do it like those fucking drug commercials pharmacy commercials truck commercials. they still fucking throw that that like i seen one commercial where there was a guy they were in a fucking movie theater because plaque psoriasis um, trying oh to, that's right and that they have one guy falling oh, he's God, like damn it. he looks like jesus Falling asleep on his <laughs> Hold on, hold on. <laughs> hey, he does. You have to watch it. I, no, I should not. They was laughing about what. The fucking horse went Jack right after me. <laughs> he knows I've been talking shit about him for years. Anyway, sorry, JP. What the fuck did that so, do to you? <laughs> you get what you deserve. So anyway, I don't think. Like that commercial, they still do the agenda driven stuff, but commercials have actually I've seen more commercials in like the last agenda driven, are you just saying like pharmacy ad like ads for drugs? No, I mean it's not just the pharmacy ads, it's also clothing ads. You you do see them, but no but when you say agenda driven, are you talking about like how everybody all of a sudden had two dads? Yes. Okay. You still see it, but it isn't as prominent Uh, anymore. Basically you're getting rammed. Um but you know, like some of the car commercials have been pretty good. Like they have these. Ford, yeah, I've, I've liked what they put on TV. Some of the shows. As soon as I met my husband, I bought a Ford. I don't know if you've ever ever heard of the show <laughs> Animal Control. Yes, he Joe rides McHale. the truck as nearly as hard as he rides me. Ball control. No. Animal Control. Animal it's a control. comedy show. It's got Nate or what's his Joel McHale. Yep. Okay, and then I know it, who that is. You don't know who that is? No, I, I know. I, I know. Yeah, and is. then it has, I can't think of who's in that show, but it, I've it's never a, heard of it. Oh, it's, it's, uh, it's just fucking, it's, it's actually great. pretty good. It's actually really great. There is no fucking laughing track. So it's, it's like, it's always, I think it came from the creators. Is it like a skit comedy show or something? Kind of. Kind of, but it's, it's, what it, it's basically Reno 911 for animals. Yes. Oh, okay. So it's a half hour show. Sold. It's, not it's fucking yeah, it great. It's fucking great. Like they, they have um an episode and I, I want to watch it. It's wow. fucking great. They had an episode where trash pandas, you know what a trash panda is? Raccoon. Raccoon. We have Raccoon. 10, 000 of them. And yeah. shit stain. So, <laughs> so they had the trash panda, and they were all getting fucking drunk in a bowling alley. <laughs> and they, the animal control got called, and they had to get the trash pandas out of the fucking bowling alley. It's great. It's well, great. I thought it was a nice skating ring. That during the hockey game. It didn't matter what, whatever it was, but it was just, imagine... Showing up and animal control is trying to control like hundreds of trash panda drunk trash pandas. Fucking no, great. those things can be fucking vicious, man. They yes, can. They can. Yep. Raccoons can be fucking mean. Have you ever gone coon hunting? Ah, uh, we, we call it coon hunting I, here. Actual raccoon hunting. There we go. Okay, cool. Just make sure Jesus we we say the full Christ. the full well, word. I was talking about fucking. Well, trash pandas are raccoons. No, no, I know. I I'm, I'm, I, I get that. I'm just saying is I would just say the whole word. <laughs> Don't abbreviate it. Sorry that my I remember ROH. language land of racism. <laughs> yeah, offended everybody. I, I don't I didn't think say it. you I have say... to understand it. We it that's what me. we have called it all of my life. I know. I'm just trying to protect you. I know why everybody's oh my god, why did he say that? Huh? If there's gonna be that one. I don't random... fucking. If you would have fucking heard, said it didn't offend him. You're in the clear. I, I know it didn't. If he would have fucking heard, if anybody's gonna be offended by that, by the way, I have. Go back and listen. I not, have, I I'm have not. I'm not. Let, from the South that let me finish. If anybody like listened to what I was talking about prior, they're not gonna care. That's the problem. Right. I'm not then blaming you. Retarded. I'm you not blaming you. Retarded. It's not you, it's not us. Huh? It's people. I guess we're doubling down. This damn society we live I in. I guess we're doubling down. All right. Is. I am saying anybody that watches it suspended, <laughs> you're a fucking idiot. If you go back and watch what I said 15 minutes well, ago. Now I'm offended. Because you me I'm J- JP, I, I, I highly I doubt anyone's going to like throw up a heevil about it. I was just I was just more busting chops more than anything else. But I just love how you're like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm just trying to protect you. Like, well, that's retarded. I'm like, well, we're just doubling down then. All right, let's just do it. <laughs> Them Double or nothing, baby. Mean. Raccoons are raccoons are fucking mean. I got chased by one. You know what? They can be fine. I think it's just like 
<clears throat> if they're, they they travel in packs, which is the problem. <laughs> It's, it's between that and they around they here, get abused. They around, get abused by teenagers. Around here they don't. Who the fuck is teen? What? Where do you live? Where randomly teenagers abuse raccoons? Yeah, that's ridiculous. <laughs> it happens in New York all the fucking time. I don't recall that. Heather. <laughs> As Ray Sean's beating the shit out of one on the kid. <laughs> Better not tell your friends. He's just fucking bubbling. I don't know what you're talking about, Heather. <laughs> The raccoons around here do not travel in packs. We see mostly. Well, they travel with the family. family. Yeah. They're a family unit for a good while before they spread off. Those fucks. So the so, there's always more them. than one of them. And the, when you open, the, when you go out in the night and there's garbage and you see them, one on them, one of them, <laughs> there's definitely another. Yeah. Yeah. I right, we uh, two years ago when we first moved in, the first summer here. Last they're year. actually pretty cute animals, man. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, they are cute. We had one like this fucking big. It's bigger than that. There we go. This big on top of our fucking trash can. I feel, like that's, not, I feel like that's not the first time, but. Okay. <laughs> no, like Excuse me, Heather, bigger than that? No, it was. <laughs> Sorry, just be an asshole. <laughs> you gotta tell the story, tell it right. Are you doing the double camera bullshit again? I just checked the fucking Discord. <laughs> he, 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 it, it, no, it was, it was about uh, that fucking big. It was, it was, it was the was size big. of a 400 pound man. No. Staring at me. It was, it was a good 30 pounds. Yeah. Needed a wheel yeah, they can get pretty fucking big, man. Um, Those motherfuckers. But no, that was last summer. We had the raccoon. You have an eight it raccoon. Anyway, this 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 gauntlet match is getting fucking chaotic. So we got Hor uh, unthinkable horse, me, basement, Himmelfarb, Piccolo, Poop Stain, Casey is raw, and JP Baker. And guess what, folks? These are still the first eight competitors out of the thirty. I wonder what a raccoon would taste like. We're not too so. Like, what are we gonna talk about? What do you think a raccoon tastes like? Shit. Have you ever had it? I have. It's you've had very... you've had oh, shit. You raccoon. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of fucked up. Why is that fucked up? You've had you shit? You said you've had shit? It tastes like shit. Right. Oh my god, why? <laughs> you said <laughs> it. You motherfuckers. Dude, this is why I hate talking to you fuckers on Sundays. On Sundays? On Sundays? It's the Lord's Day. I mean, if you wait two it hours, it'll be Monday. It literal. It annoys <laughs> the shit out of me. Good. I mean, if you want to wait two hours, it'll be, it'll be Monday. Hey, I didn't... I didn't oh, it so you've, had, you've had oh, raccoon. Fine. It I'll tell terrible? you, it tastes, it tastes terrible. Uh, how did they, like, prepare? Very, kind of, like, very, like, very gamey. I feel like, yeah, that would make sense. Is it, like, oily as shit, too? Yes. That's uh, all the garbage is it salty? <sighs> if you put salt on it. <laughs> I'm asking... I don't know. How was it prepared though? Like it was cooked in an oven? Uh, I feel like you, if you're hold, okay, uh, hold, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. My, my grandmother Ye would try it. Yes, I'm sorry, JP. I'm, sorry. Asked, I'm telling you, my grandmother. Tried it. No, no, I'm laughing at what happened in the game. I know, but I'm trying to answer the damn question. Do you think we'll fry it? It's oily meat. Frying it's going to make it taste. Worse, not I think. A, not a my fun grandma, fun. my grandma was a. She's from the south, oh, man. There you go. That's what I was just about to say. About to Speaking say. Of <laughs> catfish, catfish is a fucking delicacy down there. It makes the fact out. it's a delicacy around here. Is there a way I can make yeah. this faster? Let's see. I guess no. Nope, I guess I can't. Um. Just gonna keep an eye on Piccolo over Watch here. Watch this, Piccolo. Piccolo is fucking. This is just so. <laughs> this is so good. All right, here we go. Let me, let me just make sure I get the camera. Maybe eating turtles too. Oh wait, I can a lot zoom of in. Eat turtle soup. I didn't eat a turtle. They're just fucking awesome creatures. Okay, look, frogs. I can eat that dude. <laughs> did, wait, did he? Did he bounce it off of the ropes? He did. No, he just, did he? I thought he, he just did. fucking launched Watch the rope. Watch oh wait a minute! <gasps> he no, was the aiming rope is moving because shit he was insane. he was aiming for poop state and it went to the basement. It, uh, fucking asshole! On my back. <laughs> <laughs> and you weren't affected. You, know, you fucking no sold it. <laughs> All right, watch here. Watch Piccolo on the on the right hand side over here. See Piccolo over here, and then I don't think the ropes. I see. and then You're basement. Well, he. Wham. <laughs> 
You died. He was aiming. For, he was aiming for poop state, I think, but he got basement instead. Or at least, hold on. Let me uh, see. Tomato, tomato. At let that me, point. Let me see if he. Let me see. I'll, I'll know better if I come in from this angle. I don't think it hit. The, I'm gonna say it didn't. Hit anybody the throw a chair that, that far? far and oh wait a minute. I can get like really like. Hold on. I just realized something. POV. Uh, yeah, exactly. Go into <laughs> this, through Himmelfarb's fucking. This is gonna be. Clavicle. This is gonna be great. Hold on. Let me just back up here. Yeah, well, there we go. All right, right about here. All right, here we go. <laughs> this is like an episode of Cops. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it. Hold on. I'm going to move in just a little bit. I'm telling you, it didn't go through the ropes. You just fucking launched no, it. No, I, I guess not. It just looked. Brain <laughs> <just looked>. asshole. <laughs> <laughs> he got Holy shit. <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> we got hit with the chair. No. Uh. <laughs> 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 What's sad is I'm not even high. Okay. Back to the match. Oh, God. That was funny. The raccoon is disgusting. This. It's never easy. We surmise that. You know what the fuck Himmelfarb was just doing over to me over there? He's just like doing some uh, sort of kung fu -ry. No, TV has been better. I think over the last three, four weeks, I see a, I've seen the TV that I watch is actually been really good. Um, Any like specific I shows? Mostly, I mostly watch sport. Well, the Animal Control show. I watch. So if you really want to know what I watch on a weekly basis, Monday I watch Raw. Tuesday I watch NXT. Wednesday I'm usually doing a show with Ray Sean, or I'm watching oh. Dynamite. Yeah, we're doing our football stuff. And then Thursday, I watch Next Level Chef. And then I watch SmackDown on Friday. That's my life. But what about baseball? Oh, I watch that too. If it's on, I flip back and forth. Or I can watch it on my computer and watch it on TV. I, do, I don't really watch I do, much I do, anymore. I do things at once. When I'm watching wrestling, I'm more focused on wrestling, but oh, I check Jesus, out Thursday, Piccolo. like I did Friday. So I, if there's a football game on, that's on at noon, so I don't give a fuck. I don't have to worry about fucking it and getting involved in anything that I'm doing, you know, when wrestling comes on. Unless they're a Monday Night Raw and then the Packers are playing or the Ravens are playing or whatever. I feel like TV... if, if the Packers are not playing, I'm watching Monday Night Raw. I feel like um, TV TV's weird. I mean, I I don't know if it's if it's a I don't think it's a uh, <clears throat> like oh it's everything's better. It it's not <laughs> like you know what I mean. Like it's not like I one think, of those things. I think like... TV has actually gotten worse, but this is like mm, the difference in like what what it's... for me for what JP is watching and versus what I would watch. Oh god. Oh never mind. I thought it was glitching out. <laughs> but, like I I think like um like traditional like television shows that are like original concept tv what are you that doing, has gotten worse i think it depends on because what you everything watch everything is like checkboxed well, yeah. I, you know what's funny i was There's, i was about to say it's that it's boxing not... is fucking killing television so <laughs> what animal control does is they do have well they have an indian animal control well, I mean, I'm, like, I'm, not, I'm not against like diversity in television no, but when it's, it's but... obviously done to hit those checkboxes because that's all they see nowadays when I watch TV, it's like, okay, we're they're going to do this because this has to be in the show, oh, and this has to be in the show, and it like takes me away from whatever concept they're trying to give me. But they don't. The thing, the one thing is, they don't make a point of it that it. it so the animal control show, they don't make a point of contention that it's a certain race. If they really don't. Their boss is a woman who has. Well, so no, the, the good thing is, but, like, but if the, the thing is, is the boss is somebody that has no clue what the fuck she's doing. It's really funny. They make fun of shit on the show is what they do. Yeah, they're they're kind of I can see like well the thing is TV was so bad for like the last couple of years yeah. because they were so entrenched in like yeah, we have to include every that, level of yeah. di diversity but we also have to make that whoever we're including in diversity like super good at everything and it's like yeah. okay then you've got like the stereotypical fucking girl hero that is unstoppable at everything it's like so boring to watch man. 
So, so the main character is Joel McHale, and he's a former, actual former police officer, which makes it even better. So there's a story. There's a story behind oh, why God, he's in animal control now and not a police officer. So I actually have to. I have only watched a few episodes because mm-hmm. other things are going on. But I can DVR it. It's on one of the. It's on the. Um, what DVR you? We the library that we have uh, the, with the spectrum. Yeah. So what's the ref doing? I don't know. I'm not well, even just eliminated the horse. Yeah, <laughs> Himmelfarb did. Oh my god, and the Himmelfarb is in the chat. He shows Michael, up. Oh Michael shit! Rowland, his character in the game. Michael Rowland is in to it. To the left. Michael Rowland is in it. <laughs> down to the left. Down to the left. Kelly or Ogmundson. She's actually British. Oh, that pick up. And, and then Robbie, baby. Robbie Patel is in this. He's pretty funny. And then Sarah Chalky, she just joined the, the 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 group. The blonde chick, or the 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 chick that has no idea what the fuck is going on. Her name is Vella Lovell. She's like, oh well, uh, Himmelfarb's out. Himmel. Sure Casey is raw. Eliminated him. Italian or great? She, is this she, the end for great. It's a great. If you haven't seen it, y'all just watch it. It's. It's. I find it funny, and I Piccolo's find gone. a lot of stuff on TV not funny. Big Bang Theory, I found funny. Ugh. I think Ace th- doesn't like it because it's a laugh track. Come on, because it's not very funny. To oh, be and JP's out. Like, hey, you just hey, have hey. No, you just don't understand. Yeah, it, it, it's, um, it's not that smart either. Yo, hey, the JP. Pace of this match is picked up. J- JP mm-hmm. just got eliminated, so we're guaranteed a new champion. Good. Yeah, get in here, JP. Um, Where's your fucking laugh track now? <laughs> here comes Dora. Wait, why, is there, why is there a girl in here? But TV has yeah, gotten so much better. TV or... gotten... Wait, Gender. is Casey out? How the fuck did Casey get eliminated? Where the fuck was I? Jesus Christ. Keeps in Where was I when Casey got eliminated? Sorry, go ahead, JP. You done? Just talk. I'm trying. I mean, you talk the majority of the time. Yeah, so, so I was going to say, I, that's pretty much all I had on the TV thing. With the baseball thing, so Friday night, Willie Adamas had hit a home run. He plays for the Milwaukee Brewers. Had hit a home run off of the Baltimore Orioles pitcher. I can't remember his name. And he was catching... The catcher's name is James McCann. And he... The reason I'm saying this is I want everybody to get their thoughts on on celebrations in baseball. Let me finish the story first. So what had happened was is Willie Adamas hit a home run. And if you want to Google, it's, it's all over Google because it's a kind of a bench clearing situation. Um, you just type in Brewers Orioles bench clearing incident. Um so Willie Adamas had hit a home run the previous inning, and w- William Contreras had just hit a home run. Willie Adamas stepped up to the plate, and the catcher got in his face for some for some reason. And when I went back, we went back and watched the home run. Right now, I'm going to preface this by saying I have seen Fernando Tatis on the first pitch of a game first throw, hit a 450-foot bomb, flip his bat 50 feet in the air, and walk all the way to first base and celebrate a home run. That deserves a bench-clearing brawl, in my opinion. Willie Adamas hit the ball, looked at it, took two steps while he was looking, and then started running. Didn't really say anything to anybody. Didn't look at the catcher. Didn't look at the pitcher. Took it. Looked, looked at the ball. <laughs> took two steps. Then started running. He really didn't do a bat for that. He just flipped. He, he, he just threw the bat like most everybody else does to the fucking dugout, so that the bat boy doesn't have to run 500 feet, right? And then he started running around the bases. Well, he came up the next time, and James McCann got in his face, and it started the bench clearing brawl. My thought, my question to you: Do you think that warranted James yeah. McCann to get in the face of Willie Adamas and call him? I don't know what he said to him, but all Willie he Adamas kept repeating is, hot. "You never would have hit that. You never would have hit that. You never would have hit that." That's all he kept. Repeating. He did. He hit it 450 feet. 
And then he um, hit another ground ball into the <laughs> slot and still got another uh, base first hit. base hit and then a home run after. What was the purpose of him getting in his face? He was just, just pissed off. You. He was just pissed yeah, off. I mean, in baseball is like... The Brewers being ahead by four at that point, right? But baseball is also I like know. anything that like deviates from that. tradition sometimes. They go fucking crazy. This is like... A, certain, a lot of sports have these like things you don't do, the unwritten rule. Uh... But at the same time, it's like fucking. If, if anything needs an injection of attitude, it's fucking baseball. Yeah. Like I'm but sorry, but I if it under- warrant a bench clearing. I don't think it warranted a bench no, clearing. No, it it didn't warrant anything. It didn't warrant the catcher to get in his face at all. Now, if Fernando Tatis, if it would have been Fernando, you know, if he would have done what will what Fernando Tatis I've seen do, absolutely. Especially when the Brewers, I think they were up like eight to one at the time. If you don't want him to hit the fucking home run, start throwing strikes. Start throwing. Well, that was a strike because he hit it 450 feet. It was right down the middle of the fucking plate. But the point is, get him out. That's the only way. Like fucking today, William Contreras, second pitch of the fucking game. Corbin Burns, former pitcher for the Brewers, he won a Cy Young. Took him 430 feet. And the crowd fucking booed the shit out of him as he round the bases because he was taking his sweet ass time. The Brewers have an attitude this year. I like it, but I don't think them doing what they're doing warrants <laughs> them to be. And this isn't me being a homer. I wouldn't be mad if the Yankees did this. If you don't like it, get them the fuck out. Quit your fucking bitching. Now, when somebody flips a bat <clears throat> near 50 feet, when it's not a walk-off, come on, man. that That's fine. You're celebrating a win. That deserves a celebration. <clears throat> but the, the whole contention of getting mad because somebody took two steps, looked at the baseball, and then decided to run, that's, that's a little outrageous to me. A bunch of fucking sports guys are pussies now. They get mad at the littlest of fucking things. That's fucking annoying as fuck. I mean, half the time I think, too, it's like there's there's something else going on there where it's like, hold on, this is the outlet for anger I was looking for. Real fast. I just want to show you. She she fucking, it was like. uh, Dora the Explorer just fucking annihilate my ass. Watch this. Like, with, 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 with such, like, ease, uh, I'm sorry to, to derail the conversation, but you just gotta see this, so there's my fat ass. That's what she learned, she, that's what she learned by fucking exploring. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, <laughs> fucking to a pile driver, yeah. good lord. Anyway, continue. Yeah, I, I feel like with sports, I mean, this is like, it's not just baseball, too, because it's the same thing happening in, like, basketball, and for a while there it was happening in football. It's yeah. like, how much celebrating is too much celebrating? Much, yeah. And half the time it's like, unless it's like fucking egregious, ridiculous shit, who cares? Like, the, like, right. and there's these butt hurt fucking the, the other <laughs> team that's like, oh, we're fucking losing. So I guess, oh, the, <laughs> time to take my anger out on whatever. Yeah. But if and you don't like me, get him out. Throwing at him isn't going to fucking solve the goddamn yeah, Play thing. better. <laughs> if if don't you fucking... throw at somebody after somebody hits a home run, you get kicked out of the game. Yeah. Especially if there is some tension because the umpires, and I yeah, I think it's I great. The umpires don't take shit at all. They, they don't take no shit. Like, if you want to fucking argue with them, like, they'll let them go on a couple of things. Like, if you start arguing balls and strikes, you're gone. You're gone. And they'll, they'll throw somebody, like, if they there's, like, something there the tension and you can tell when it's gonna happen and then the person gets thrown at the umpire immediately ejects that guy and then warns the bench see, no it's the I'm, same feeling you get when you see two dogs well he warns at both benches no yeah. himmelfarb said it happens a lot in the nba and he's right okay. but i think there's a big problem with the nba where it's the uh the problem that is actually happening in just like the population as a whole where like a lot of like the new age the younger crew are are so like there's so much ego because of like well well, it's like i think there's so much ego because of like um the social era and everybody's like their own personal fucking social media star yeah yes that like you bring that into the mix and you get people like 
and in the NBA, there's a lot of like the fucking old heads or whatever they want to call them. These guys that are like traditional, you don't. You, there's certain things you don't do, and they these new fucking like e- egomaniacs are basically gonna do whatever they want, and this is where like problems happen. And I'm sure that's in every sport at this right. point in time, because like if if you're a, <coughs> if you're a pro athlete, you're also like a social media mogul. You're also like a bunch of different fucking things. I think social media is like the social media fucking fa- fandom is turning a generation that's like below us. Like the 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 people that are like eighteen year old, nineteen, twenty, twenty, twenty two, are mm-hmm. like in trouble because of it. <laughs> I know. There's a bunch of fucking people that think they're kings of the world. You think TikTok is the answer to everything. TikTok is disgusting. Get you out of your paper bags. It's pork laser. Me and Basement are still alive in this thing. God knows how. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm standing unconscious, getting beaten up by a man dressed as a raccoon. Bork, yeah. <laughs> Bork laser is coming in at number 15. This marks the... Holy shit. Oh, and going out. It's officially, oh, wow. it's officially the halfway <laughs> mark, but... Um, is that Rigby? It is Rigby. From a, yeah. yep. Getting beaten up by who's that? Is that? There was... When you were trying to show what Dora was doing to you in the replay, I thought it was a naked man. I had the tail <laughs> hunt. You know, it was we, uh, the part I giggled at randomly earlier that I, I, I didn't get a chance to explore more was Alpha when he came out. The second he just walked over and then just ran and fucking need the Easter Bunny right in the fucking head. Like, that was the first thing he did. He just walked over the stairs like, hey, and then he's like, hurrah, and then just, bam, cracked him in the fucking nose. I'm like, Jesus. So, what the? Uh, have, you, have you noticed this guy? Uh, have you have you guys noticed this with, like, uh, at my work, we just got, like, people that are re- relatively new hires, and some of them are, like, a bit younger. But, like, nobody can fucking speak. No, not speak, but nobody can Right, properly. No. Oh, you talking? You, are you talking about like, like? I mean, like, I get everybody makes like grammatical uh-oh. mistakes. I get everybody makes like uh, mistakes when typing, but like actually, like, like actually was the fucking word, Pembership? and Pembership? it was a it, it was it was fucking spelled a k s a u. I'm like, how do you how do you exist? How do you exist? A k s a u l l y. Actually. Yeah, this was the, the way the person was typing things. And I'm oh, like, that's I, the, on this I, didn't, I didn't know that's how you actually typed it. <laughs> oh shit! Like, I'm just, like I'm just I'm just saying like a uh, like. Oh, I man. feel like if you could spend the energy to spell something wrong, you could spend the energy, the same energy and time to spell it right. So, so this is like this is online like when people are like, I speak, uh, I speak in slang, right? When I'm talking, but when I type. I mean, like, typing in slang must be a fucking chore. I'm saying, like, constantly in, in slang, where, like, uh, there's oh. some things I see tweeted, and I'm like, I don't know what the fuck you're actually trying to say, because I'm not 10 years old and with an extra chromosome. I think, so my dad, I don't know if this is a form of dyslexia, but he would he would probably spell actually the same way because that's he probably would have said a x u a l l y. It's probably See, a it variation. It doesn't matter if I'm like I'm I'm messaging you, but at like I mean, like a, a professional, professional workspace, level? like yeah. holy shit, man. You might want to. Oh, you should see some emails like I'm sure you got them English too. Basement is, is yeah, so, so, bad, like it's man. it's it's funny how like there's such a it, to, to me that what makes it so interesting is like. If it was a if it was a wide variety like a wide majority yeah I'd be I'd be fucking concerned, but it's not. But that being said, it is funny to see the fucking scale of, um you know yes. these eloquently w- written words and stuff like that that uh you know oh I guess I'm gonna eliminate basement here one, two, bye basement. You know what I'm challenging you. Okay, you're gonna put your WTF title on the line. Uh well yeah <laughs> okay. If so, if so, if and I win, whatever title you might have, we'll I, title it off. I only have a title. I have uh, tag titles. Okay, well, whatever. Well, all right, you hey, know. Here's with the sun. Yep. Oh yeah, you fucking took that from me too. Sure yeah. did. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's okay. Cody's about to eliminate me, so. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 
How about um, Connor and Basement has a I am your poppy match for Maybe just... the WTF championship and one half of the tag team championship. If Basement wins. You know what? Yeah, I kind of I kind of I kind of wish <laughs> That's uh, okay. Uh, I kind of wish you could put one half of the tag titles on the line. I mean, we, we could like. <laughs> and Rigby's say gone. You did it? Yeah, no, no, I know, I know uh, yes. that. Yes, Elmo Farber, I do need a tag partner. So it's JP fucking aborted me. <laughs> okay, so all right, let's. You you, you want to do that? Do you want to do? do uh, let's do a WTF match, me versus you. Yep. And let's do a tag match, me and Elmo Farber versus you and your son. Okay, I almost took out Bork Laser. And here comes number 17? Yes. 16. Bum chuck it. Yes, bum chuck it. I believe in you. By the way, this is to crown a new... Oh, oh God. Basement. No, he's taking the stairs. No, 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 no. Stairs? You missed oh, it. Oh, 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 Jesus. Okay, there. Bum chuck it. Taking him out. He's my pick to win. The amount of people that I work with that... Can't spell loose. It's always loose. Everything is loose. Dude. Hey, I fucked up my first shirt. Like, fits, uh, like I get like the there, there, there thing. Yeah. Yeah. But but like lose and lose, lose um, and loose. There is. Hey, wow. yeah, just throwing this out there real quick. I, I apologize to cut off the the conversation, but does anybody else notice that the crowd is all vastly looking to the left and there's yeah. nothing going on over there? <laughs> Yeah, they're watching me leave. <laughs> oh yeah, even though that's I left like is. fucking forty minutes. Ago. Yeah, like they're all like <laughs> reacting to whatever's going on. Do they all have lazy eyes? Like, what's going on? Mm-hmm. I Shawn fighting in a crowd. Are uh, they waiting for? Here we go. You know what Yoda said when he found out he was on four K. K four, I do. HDMI. <laughs> that's better. I've heard that one. That's good. <laughs> Oh shit, who's out next? No! Oh, kick out. Easter Bunny. I've been, st- watch- I've been watching that Ya Mad channel, man. That's so fucking funny. Oh my god. Dora, you bitch. You'll tore the whore. Like, like uh, you know Slava Milosevic, right? Of course I do. His brother is a hooker. <laughs> male hooker. You know what his name is? Slap it down on my suck. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Slap it down on my ding dong. Slap it down on my. Slap it down on my. It's not. No, it's it's it. it Slap it down. Slap it down. Slap it down on my cock, you bitch. It's not. It's not that you screwed up. It's the fact that like slap it down. Fuck me. <laughs> like, it, it actually, <laughs> like you yelling like absurdities that you fucked up actually fits with the parameters of the joke. Slap it down on my cock. You and bitch. bye-bye Easter Bunny. Oh! So OJ um, died. Oh man, oh, I, you know how many jokes yeah, I saw about that recently? Which is, oh. there's two of them uh, that I saw that were the best. One was, it was a clip, it was a, you know, a still image of the Bronco chase and said, man, if they don't do this at his funeral, that's a disappointment. <laughs> and then the other, the, the other one was someone quote tweeted it and said, um, you know, it was like, oh, OJ Simpson dead at, uh, you know, whatever his age was. 76. And uh, he quote tweeted it and said, oh, Easter Bunny's gone, and said, uh, I'm glad to know that OJ can finally rest knowing that his wife's killer is dead. <laughs> yeah, that one was good. My like, shit, that's <laughs> fucking clever. That's Brad Williams, the midget comedian. Oh, that's right, that was Brad. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I couldn't remember who it was that said that, yeah. Same oh, shit. We did. Said, uh, what the fuck, OJ's here. <laughs> we want some juice. Uh, the, the, the thing I shared with OJ... <laughs> After the interview, he played a joke on me where he showed up in my fucking room, stabbing me in the face. <laughs> I still. Do you ever hear the? Do you ever see the? Or you ever hear the bit with uh, Chappelle meeting him? Uh, I probably have. It's it's a it's a bit of a drawn out story, but it's great because basically, and I'm gonna paraphrase this. And again, I can't do Dave Chappelle fucking justice, so you have to go see it. Jesus, Cody. Well, there goes Furious George. Cody, I swear to fuck if you eliminate me. Cody. Cody, eliminate Cody. 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 Yes. So I That's remember done. when all of that this. Chum bucket. I remember when all of that shit went down. 
So do I. I wow. do too. Bum truck is out. Cody is crushing I it right now. I don't think we remember that. I was a full grown fucking adult. I, was... I remember on every TV you turned on, it was the fucking slowest moving Bronco in the world. Was it in 1995? You were eight or nine. Nine then, yeah. That's but it was, on, it was on every channel. I'm you could have flipped funny. through every fucking channel on the TV, and that motherfucker was driving slow. At, yeah. that t- at that time, I was 22. I was 22 years old when that happened. And I laid there, and I watched this, and I said, he's going to end up not being guilty. Or not being, yeah, not being guilty. And I was fucking right. I, um... Well, he was 100% guilty. No, 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 I'm not going to say he didn't do it. But the woman that was his prosecutor is a fucking idiot. Yes. The funniest thing is, like, if if the glove doesn't fit, I'm like, the glove actually fits. Right. That's <laughs> not going to fit because he's already wearing a glove to protect the well, evidence. They actually brought in the fucking glove that he fucking used. In the fucking murder. I'm like, how is this logical? Doesn't blood cause things to shrink at some point? Like, I'm like sitting here thinking, why is this woman? I don't, I'm not even fucking as smart as she is. But I even, I know not to fucking put that, have that happen. Have him put the glove on that he actually used. How about you look and see what glove it is and then have him put the fucker on. You can't most, have him put on the glove he actually fucking used. The most fucked up thing about this whole thing is, like, everybody in the world is like, yeah, he did it. But the actual murder is fucking brutal Gruesome. as shit. Yeah. Like, I agree with you. Everybody's like, yeah, he I, killed I, her, he just killed her, whatever. It's like, holy shit, he, like, stabbed again, her so hard it went fucking through her or some shit. I yeah, if she had both carotid and both jugular veins. Well, didn't he have the same? Yeah. Do you think he did a fucking touchdown dance after he did it? He oh my god. god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I don't know you fucking what. fucking mega brick. <laughs> I'm not going to say because uh, he, he was found not guilty. Shit. So I am of the contention that... But who else is like... I'm not saying he didn't... <laughs> <laughs> this like the mysterious man showed up who was like a crime of passion who was also Probably. like super strong. Why is he spiking your head? I'm not disagreeing that he did it at all. He's doing I'm just saying officer, that. he's doing the stinky leg. He fucking came up with a book that if I did it, this No no, is what that, I that never got published. <laughs> okay, I get what you're saying. I'm not disagreeing with you. My point is I don't think the prosecution did a very good job of preventing No, they failed. They, mean, they failed miserably. Yeah, that's what I was trying to... I, I, did he do it? I can almost guarantee he... Oh, did he did it. Did he, though? Did he do it. <laughs> but, yeah, I... So I remember that whole thing when it went down. How can you murder I remember somebody too. that's close to you like that and consciously... It's a crime of passion because she was cheating uh, I, I was about to say, it like... It was a crime of passion. It was a crime of passion. And she also, he also killed the man she was fucking banging. Yeah. In his house. Mm-hmm. But he didn't do it. No. Oh, I he did it. I... God, fucking door I mean, looks like shit. Like, the fucked up thing is, if he did do it, this mm-hmm. is why that that video I sent was fucking wild. It's like, if he did do it, then he's interviewing so the, the this woman's interviewing him, and he's like, "No, I didn't do it." And it was like obvious, like lies. And then he shows up at her fucking hotel room, knocks on the door with the fucking, and he's got a knife in his hand. He's fucking Jason Voorheesing her. That was it's, fucked up behavior. Oh, hold on, hold on. What the? Oh, never mind. Got cut off. I was like, it, it was so bad. Basement, did you read the chat? Yeah, you fucking piece of crap. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's going to happen? After me and Himmelfarb win the championships from Connor yeah. and his son, Congrats. we're going to fucking gang rape you in the back. <laughs> well, I, okay. Again. <laughs> well, through with that. <laughs> I'm gonna go grab some I'm brownies. I'll be right back. The glove won't fit. The glove and then won't everybody fit. Everybody wonders why I don't want him to be my partner anymore. <laughs> Listen, I was so supportive, but then you betrayed me by not sticking with me. Most of the matches, you stood on the apron. 
I was ride or die, okay? You Every time you got in the fucking ring, you got your ass fucking beat. You well, pulled a Homer Simpson. You I was ride or die. I was, got back out. You guys are remembering it correctly. <laughs> it's like the OJ trial all over again. <laughs> <laughs> Look. I was ride or die, okay? You betrayed me. Yep, so OJ dying. I I got to watch him play football and we got to watch him in the movie. Got to watch all oh, that fucking movie. <laughs> uh, <laughs> he was good in that movie. Norbert. It was a sign of things to come. It certainly was. I bet you there's people that watch those scenes over and over again it saying, God, he deserved that for everything he got there. Um mm-hmm. So yeah, I, I, I there isn't too much more. I just remember all that shit going down. It was all over all over the fucking TV, man. All over it. Cause when did didn't he just like he was a pretty huge star at that time because they were getting ready to do another or they had done or finished Naked Gun or whatever. They were in post production. Right. It was it was crazy, man. It's crazy. That's all I got. Sorry. No, he's dead. Yeah, he died. What? I don't care. I don't care, personally. I mean, OJ. Because everybody fucking dies, right? We're all gonna <laughs> die. I, to that point, I'm, I'm to that point. I'm not, not that I want to die, but it's, it's inevitable. No, no, I just... That took a dark, serious turn real fucking hard. <laughs> I, so I'm, I'm talking about him dying is all I'm saying. I no, mean, I, I, I get that, but you're like... I say this for about any celebrity that dies, like, it doesn't affect me because I didn't care about the guy. I mean, yes, he's a big pop culture icon. He is a piece of media history that I don't think will ever it's one of the top things that's ever happened newsworthy wise I guess at that time pop culture I don't didn't mean for it to be dark I was trying to get everybody to understand my thought process I apologize Honestly, no I, you're good I, it was just the way you presented I, it was kind of funny and I yeah. understand JP saying that because it's like once you lose your parents well I, honestly, I'm I'm there, JP. I feel. But it. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not. You know, going to a dark place. I'm good. I'm not depressed or anything. I'm actually kind of happy with my life. You know. No, but, but it, no, and I, I get it. I get it. I get it. Um, I just don't understand people that are like so significant, significantly impacted by like people that they that they're, that's not in their life. It's like, oh my god, every, this person every, died, and it's well, like, I, I, my I, life I, will never be the same. Like, this know, happened with, like, Bray Wyatt, it happened with, uh, Eddie White. whoever that fucking, uh, the, the Spanish actor recently that was, like, a fucking 20-year-old or something, who drove his motorcycle into a wall. Oh, uh, I forget his name. I don't oh, care. Okay. I just, like, I, I, I did this from, like, a young age, when I was back in fucking grade school. And, like, one of the kids at our school died, right? We had an aneurysm yeah. while he was sleeping. And every single fucking person that never talked to him, didn't like him, was like, oh, my God. Well, I think and they all just the, fucking broke down in tears. And I'm like... It's the initial shock, I think. I just don't get the idea of it's like, I had no interactions it. with this person. I have nothing to do with them. But I'm going to become, like, the center of attention by I fucking don't... bawling my eyes out in front of people. I'm I like, think, I think that, I think that depends... Fun. I think that depends on the person. I will. I. I, I get. <laughs> I get where you're coming from. Sorry, I just, your last line just cut up with me. Um, <laughs> um, I think there are people out there that do honestly feel that way and like just like take advantage of it and whatnot and like, you know, the, the sympathy. Great, cool. All right, game crashed. Awesome. Um, so well, I guess we'll never know who won the title. I think it was me. <laughs> you were already That's eliminated. Right. Are you fucking kidding me? Um, but I do think I think it's more so people. Um. Sometimes they're grieving not because of the person, but more it's a, just a general realization of like, you know, uh, the the shortness of life and mortality, et cetera, et cetera. Don't get me wrong, there are pieces of shit who will like, you're like, he was so great. It's like you fucking shoved him in a toilet two weeks ago. What the fuck's wrong with you? I think people are fucking dickheads most of the time. 
he crashed the game. Technically. By just by just having a fucking gauntlet match. 2K? Huh. God damn it. To be fair, they're a bunch of freaks. <laughs> So, so any celebrity, like everybody, when Kobe Bryant died, I'm like, oh, that's, that's, that's sad. You know what was and more sad was fucking my daughter day. died in the whole thing. And I get that, but I don't know her. I mean, I just came from my aunt's that. funeral literally I, yesterday. I, I, and the thing is, like, I, I can, so, like, be like, okay, it's sad that, that someone that, young that, dies. Yes, but I think, well, like, I'm with JP. I don't know them. Hey, ba hey, ba yeah, and unfortunately, well, well, the, I feel the, bad that they died. I feel, I do feel bad that. But what are you going to do? Fucking rewind time and have the helicopter fly yeah, I mean, I'm, 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 you know, I'm heartbroken when my family members die. 100%. Yeah, but, well, that's understandable. Because, like, everybody I, has this, like, bubble they live in, so, like, you can't share... I can't... I, I have yet to see someone that's a legitimate, like, bleeding heart that is emotionally... Like, legitimately emotionally distraught with someone they don't know. And and, and I would be like, that's kind of weird because that is an outlier for human behavior. There's a reason we don't care if people aren't fully attached to us. Otherwise, everybody on this planet would be fucking perpetually depressed all the time. Yeah. That's actually a very good point. Mason, what kind of match do you want to do for your belt? Uh, uh, let's do two or three falls. Me so, versus you, bitch. Yeah. Um, you want to do two or three falls? I don't have anything else. I think it's There's in the, like, once you do a normal there. match, it's in the settings. Is there anything else going on in the wonderful world? Uh, I, did see that, I did see that I'm... Fuck, shut up. I did see. I did see that Iran did bomb fucking Israel or attacked Israel or whatever. Oh my god! What's our world coming to? Anyway. Well, I mean, the thing is, I actually think there is like a fucking war crime going on between Israel and the Gaza Strip, and most of the world is partnering with Israel, so they're like. Flowers, flowers, it's all great. Nothing's bad. Okay. So, I mean, when people see what's happening there that are closer than we are, and they rebel against Israel, mm -hmm. I, you know, mm -hmm. I can tell so Israel, 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 can, Israel can't defend themselves, is what you're saying. The fuck? From the Gaza Strip? Which is like hell on earth? They aren't defending themselves from the Gaza Strip. They're defending themselves from a fucking group of fucking terrorists. That's what they're defending themselves from. They aren't defending mm -hmm. themselves. Everybody that thinks they're defending themselves from the Gaza Strip are a bunch of fucking idiots. Well, they they're are bombing not, the fucking Gaza Strip, the regardless if it's Hamas there or not. Strip, the, 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 that's exactly who runs that strip. That is the government there. That is so the because government. the American government runs America, you'd be okay if they bombed a school in America. I, I didn't hear you. You said what? Because the American government runs America, if someone bombed a school in your fucking neighborhood, does not you'd be okay the with the strip. That's not what I'm saying. I don't get what you're saying then. I don't get your point. My point is you're saying you're equating Hamas to the Gaza Strip and it being one and the same. Well, that <clears throat> Hamas runs it because they were voted into the government. Yes. Over okay. There. Well, my my what I just said makes sense then. But Israel does not. I'm it's not about attacking. Israel. But you're saying if I'm, you just said why would the so it's okay for the United States to bomb the United States school. I don't I'm not understand. saying the United States is bombing the United States school. I'm saying if the United States had an enemy and they bombed a school in your neighborhood because the United States is governs the U.S., you're there's okay with that? Even if there's in. no, even if there's no U.S. government in that school or anything, it's just kids. So you're talking about casualties of war? Yeah. Okay. Well, that happens in war. What do you want me to fucking do? Tell everybody to fucking play nice? Yeah. Everybody who is not involved in Hamas was told to get out. 
Shit fucking oh, happened. And go where? The border's cut off from both sides. They were told where are they go going? Fucking basement. They were told to fucking get out of there, and they had opened up a fucking border for them to go to. They were told to where? they could not go there because fucking Hamas would not let them fucking leave because they want to use them as casualties, which is what you're seeing. They where were they supposed to, where was they, what was the border built. what was oh, the border God. they were going to ah egypt 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 closed that fucking border man and they opened they it again opened after it. u.s military showed up to help keep things under control i don't know man i think there's like a, a, a vision of things that isn't necessarily true when it comes to everything that's happening there guy looked like a tool <clears throat> What kind of arena is this? this is the United the... States bombed Japan in World War II. Is, is that justified? This is the TBD uh, uh, arena, man. which is part of one of the My Rise uh, things. It. Casualties of war, man. I'm sorry. That's just the way, that's the way it is. Things. I don't think you'd share the same sentiment if it happened in your neighborhood, is all I'm saying. You wouldn't be casualties of war. My family's dead. <laughs> I think you're missing the fucking point. I'd be fucking distraught. I would be distraught. I'm not saying I wouldn't be distraught. However, I would try to get the fuck out of there if I'm fucking told to. I would find a fucking way to fucking leave. That's what I would do. And if that way shut itself off to you? And you and your family got fucking obliterated because of it? I would do everything I could to get the fuck away. And you don't think that's what's happening there? I'm not saying that they're not. All right. I think I think people are missing. This happened every war that there is that we've been a part of. There even even in the wars that we've been involved in. Yeah. That I've seen shit, guys. It happens. A casualty of war, and it sucks. This is why. When you see these fucking dumb fucking people on fucking Twitter saying shit, and then I got to I actually jump on there and say, "Have you ever you ever been in a fucking war?" You have to fucking understand there's going to be and it sucks and I get it and I fucking understand. I'm not condoning it. I am saying that it is not any it's going to be almost unavoidable in a fucking war. I'm sorry. But I think a lot of what's happening over there has been happening for like 70, 75 years. It is just it. like this why this is why I was saying war crime because how long that shit's been going on. You got people like the, the population of the Gaza Strip is monstrous for how big it is. They have been because they won't be able to go anyway. Region. They have been fighting in that region since the beginning of fucking time. I mean, uh, from the time that humans were able to fucking learn how to fucking fight each other, that fucking, that fucking region has been at war. And well, why do you think that is? Because they don't fucking like each other. One side's Jewish, the other side no, is Muslim. No, it's none of them. None of them fucking like each other. So th- there's a real funny thing, and this is where the history of this fucking thing comes to me. When I'm sitting in classes for a year having to understand why these fucking countries are the way they are. They have two different beliefs. There's the Shiites and the Muslims, right? And then you have the the Israel, which is the, the, the Hebrew religion, right? Or the Jewish religion, right? It's the same thing. So the problem is... The Shiites don't like the fucking Sunnis. The Sunnis don't like the Shiites. The Sunnis and Shiites don't like the fucking Jewish people. It's just one big cluster fuck of shit over there is what it is. It's unfixable. You should just let them fucking destroy each other. That's personally what I think they should do. Just fuck it. Let them kill each other off. Just nuke the whole area. Okay. <laughs> well, that's another option. <laughs> And restart. Technically, that's an option in anything. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't think the problem is it's like that. an area. It's it's an area that I I think has been like um, 
Oh, because wait. of like the Jewish influence on media, I feel like there is an unfair viewpoint being put on Israel. <laughs> mm-hmm. More so than the other yeah. side. But they, but they, they, so they, they've been. That's why they fight over there is because the Shiites don't like the Sunnis, the Sunnis don't like the Shiites, and the Sunnis and the Shiites don't like like them. I think that's why people are that's like problem. people would say like war crime because you're looking at like an established country of Israel versus like what is literally a ghetto and has been a ghetto for so long. In the ghetto. Well, you, you, you so they might not there. like Look, each other, but it's like over there, even, even in fucking Israel, it's a fucking ghetto. In the ghetto. I don't think so. I don't think Israel's a ghetto. In the ghetto. I don't know. I've never been there. In gray Chicago, but, a baby I mean, it's one of those things that I, I don't have the knowledge base to really go more into that. Or anything. So I just, I just. One thing my shut, my shut. But I, I feel like any any conflict I've ever seen, there's two sides of the story, and yeah. there's one side being prominently shown. Ca- well, showcased yeah, to like us this match where you're kicking media. my ass. I get what you are saying. Okay, here class. they're going. They're here in in the United States. We defend Israel. To the hilt. Yeah, because even, uh, like even, I said, the, the Jewish in, influence on the uh, on America in general, in, including Canada, is huge. And I, I agree. I agree with you. And they, that's we we will oh, defend. Wait, that's why we go to. That's why we went to war in the first place. Is to defend. It's actually to defend Israel. And and I don't. Israel can help defend themselves that's how like but, I, sometimes it's better just like stay out of it yeah just, i agree i yeah. wish we would stay the Slim fuck Jim. out of it but if Between we do that and if ukraine. we do stay but there's related to like, ukraine as well yeah but ukraine i hold on one second get back on the stream here ah shit hold on all right Wait, what? Good reaction, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let me get this bad boy up and running. Sorry for the delay, folks. My Wi-Fi just wanted to be a total dickhole. JP, save that. We'll watch that right after. Okay. Gotcha. Fucking Connor, so worried about fucking... I'm just kidding. I can, I can, I can leave. I don't want to. Shit, man. Make like a tree and grow. Uh, all right. Well, anyway, back to the match. Uh, so what we were talking about? Yes. One, two. Is this a two out of three falls match? It is. And I did I get that fall? Nope. Oh, it's the only time we're not seeing the bars. And the, yeah, there we go. <laughs> all right, we should be back. Let me know in the chat, guys, if uh, you can see or hear everything. I think we should be back up and running, as far as I know. Fingers crossed. Look at that. Look at that power. All in my pussy i i have okay. no damage on you basement try. i I've, I've gotten look, look at the damage d- difference between the two of us basement's fucking slaughtering me right now and he just beat the <laughs> shit out of me with a with a slim jim and now he's gonna do the same thing with a fucking slipper are nope, you nope, the last microphone. dude in this fucking stupid match? No, that, the game crashed. So yeah, the game to... crashed during the title <laughs> match, so JP, you miraculously kept the uh, HDW championship. Oh, okay. Uh, she did uh, win? I see, I see what oh, happened oh, oh, there. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, listen, you just beat the shit out of me with a Slim Jim 10 minutes ago. So. You're going to need bear spray. <laughs> Probably a good idea. Um, Has anybody here been, like, hit with pepper spray? Yes. No, not yet. Yes. How did you hit with pepper spray, Connor? So, it wasn't by accident. <laughs> Neither was mine. Neither was mine. <laughs> that's, all, that's all I'll say. Well, what did you guys do? <laughs> To deserve such I grew up with a family that had police want, officer friends. You wanna know Oh, you I, just did it to like experience it or that, like, that's why I did oh, it. No. You want you wanna know you wanna part. know you wanna know what I did? You wanna know what I did? You yourself, didn't you, dumbass? I joined the army. <sighs> to, but yeah, but the, the army they just <laughs> we have we actually have Basically, to go dick. into I've done it three times. Yeah. We actually have to go into they stopped doing it. Yeah, because it's abusive as fuck. No, it's not. It's not. It's just... How bad is it on a scale of one? To so we, so we, once a year, in or we had, we have 
protective mask in the military to protect us from biological and chemical warfare. Well, nuclear, biological, and chemical warfare. But I don't think that's stopping a nuclear bomb. But anyway. The goggles, they do nothing. <laughs> yeah. So they seal off pretty good. Like, they seal off pretty good. They get, like, 99% of the particles. What are you doing? So the masks are pretty good. They're filtered Dang. and everything. But... We did that three three times a year where we, you know, tear gas. We had to go into a room where they just set off a tear just like gas a bomb. Fucking police and just, academy. We have to stand there. We have to take our take off our masks. We have to look up, look down, or look up, look down, look left, look right, and then they pop the smoke, and then we have to put our mask back on in, in 15 seconds. It's what just it's just training. It's just what training. was the was was uh, tear gas or fucking um, pepper spray worse? So I can tell you right now, tear gas sucks dick. I can imagine, yeah. You can't fucking breathe because you're more worried about fucking trying to hold your breath because <laughs> you don't want to fucking inhale this shit. It's pretty bad, man. And you're fucking, you walk out, snot fucking running out of your mouth, eyes teared up, you can't fucking see shit. It's fucked up, man. It, it burns, it, it burns like fuck. It burns bad. Um, but then what I will say is that, like, it's more so the, the, at least for me anyway, it was more so the idea of, like, come on, fucking end, get it over with. Like, just, like, okay, like, like let's heat the, let's heat the threshold, like, then let's at least, like, fucking, can we plateau on the pain here? And, uh, oh, that took a while. I like it. I liken tear gas to an entire bottle of Tabasco sauce in your eye. I mean, I haven't done that either, so. And you can't blink your eye as they're pouring the Tabasco sauce in your eye. Mm -hmm. That's what it feels like. It sucks. It's good. Kick out, bitch! I've done a shot of Tabasco sauce. Yeah. I've done shots with Tabasco sauce in them. Prairie Fire. Oh yeah, sure. We have a drink. We have, we have. I mean, Tabasco Mary. sauce isn't like you. Like it's, it's. It's not. No, it's not. It's very not the hottest enough. fucking thing. It's it is for me, man. Thing. That shit fucking destroyed me. Never I tried sriracha. Sauce. Sriracha. The problem with sriracha, I don't find it too hot, but it fucking obliterates my asshole. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Like whatever other. fucking chili pepper they put in there is like. It's, it's, worse than my it's worse than my bottom lips. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't do. I man. love hot sauce, though. I, I, I am a wuss when it comes to spice. Oh Jesus! Me too. Me too. I can't. I've gotten better. I think I, I'll eat a little bit of a spicy something, but Ooh, could... I won't. Come on. I won't go too far. Oh, there's the there's He's the sandal. Healthy, so. Nope. I so I will never ever eat so a story about Damn the whole you idiot. I don't like how this is part of the reason why I don't like there spicy you. food. So I what got my dry I don't Sorry. know. Not you. Ah. So I got yes. my driver's I got my driver's license that you know mom took me to the took me to the thing. I got my driver's Oof, license. Geez. So my mom took me to the sure. bar she worked at. <laughs> To, and, to the shop. Oh, by the way, uh, side note, basement. Not that this is any more motivation for you to beat me. If uh, if I win this belt, this means I will have won every male champ. Oh, fuck that! I will have won every male championship available because I've tagged. I've won the tag titles. I've won the no bucks given. I've won the OHD dub. So this is the last belt on my list. Oh god! All I'm gonna say is, uh, who's the person that's been booking ninety percent of this? You guys. Mm-hmm. Hey, I didn't want to challenge for the belt. You literally threw the challenge out. So, just so I can beat you good. Well, you're winning so far. My mom took you to go celebrate. My mom took me to go celebrate at the bar, and the owner, who I've known since I was a little kid, uh, he's like, here, have one of these. I, I'm a dumb... I think I was 18 when I got my license. 18-year-old kid... Trying to prove that I can hang with the big dogs. So I, they gave me a jalapeno pepper, and he said, here, this, eat this. He said, you got to eat the whole thing. You can't just take little bites. You got to eat the whole thing. So I put the whole thing in my mouth, crunched down on that motherfucker. 
And it's one of those hot fucking jalapeno peppers. Well, so it was a small one. That's all. Oh my say. god, it destroyed the fuck out of me. I went into the fucking bathroom and puked. Yep, I can't. I can't <laughs> handle that shit. You no, know, it, it is like one of those things though, where like you either have a oh, palate for it or me. you don't. Yeah. Bye, son. Get the fuck out of the room. Wow. I'm just telling for you. For me, that I can't taste anything when I eat it. I it just it like ruins my taste buds. The thing is, I'm. It's weird because I'm not a fan of like peppers in their like natural form, but I love hot sauce. Just got to do it. One, two, basement retains. That's how it's done, baby. <laughs> I'm coming for. Oh, that sounds weird. <laughs> <laughs> That was, that was, man, you cut off at the right word. <laughs> I'm coming for your guy. Me and him will far, but uh, he the family. People fucking having a fucking meltdown. All right. People what? are still having a fucking meltdown over the Roman and Cody thing. Why? Really? How dare it even happen? That, that ending was fucking great. <laughs> you can eat a dick. All right, what type of match are we doing for these uh, tag straps? Mm. Ladder? What? Ladder? Oh, ladder <coughs> devolves hey. into two. <coughs> okay, so hold on, Rayshon. Cage turned into everybody fucking straddling the cage for forever. Hello, Cell. <coughs> uh, you know what, Connor? You can pick since I spanked you. No, I ya. mean, you could just make the rule that um, it's either pinfall, submission, over the top, or through a door. So, <coughs> that doesn't Solve the problem. <laughs> it does solve the problem. He said people was going to. It doesn't solve the problem with the AI team. being retarded. Yeah. Yeah. But ooh, that was in the last ooh, game. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. No, but that's just like KO backstage brawl. Uh, okay. Fair enough. Uh, let's do. We're gonna have to do mixed gender, because you a bitch. No. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was. That was. That was actually fucking great. <laughs> oh, that was fucking great. Yeah, you can pick whatever. <clears throat> I did TLC. <clears throat> All right, so it's Basement and Himmelfarb. <clears throat> yeah. Team, well, I don't know. We need to come up with their name for ourselves. Well, how about you guys win first? Yeah. That would work. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Score. That's, that's, that's the only like burn I'm gonna get the entire fucking stream. <laughs> Where the fuck did he put his name under? Hold on. Oh, my X son's even. name. <laughs> Do this. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that is a fucking <laughs> choice. He's got ball. Is a ball chinian. I'm gonna keep that. <laughs> oh, fuck it. That's great. All right. Um, it's like someone put a bicycle pump in him. There they are. I'm like, I thought oh, I, I'm like, we had the <clears throat> coming for you, Connor. Holy it's your son. What a match. For you. <laughs> We're changing all of that, right, Connor? We already talked about that. Changing what? What I just discussed with you before we started the show. I'm looking at what you have. Oh yeah, that that card that card so that card was made before we even talked. I I made that earlier today. Maybe we should let Ray shot. And I'm gonna. I'm gonna, so. Like I said, everybody... that is not that is not in stone. I just threw that together. Right. Just to help get the creative juices flowing for you. So yep. and then I made a suggestion to. Which I still want to do, but after King of the Ring. And that's fine, but. I'm going to tell everybody so we can get hyped for the show here. God damn. I'm God. fucking hyped, dog. So I have nothing else to really talk about. So we can we can talk about what we're going to do. Um, the Miz presents. That's the first do. week. I got something first... to talk about. OJ Simpson died. Oh, my God. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Nobody fucking cares. <laughs> the juice is loose. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> I mean, he'll start the bone field. I that. Never mind. I'm just gonna shut up. Want to see him as entrance here? I was gonna take. You guys thought I was dark before. I was gonna take it. <laughs> He's like, well, the bone. Never mind, guys. I'm not gonna tell yeah, you. Yeah, you don't. You don't. You don't want me to go there. Um. 
So what we're doing the first three weeks, the suggestion was, and I love this this suggestion. Because it was yours? Well, I, this is what I did for my <laughs> my universal mode. I suggested we do gauntlet matches mm-hmm. for, for the world title, right? And that's all 20 of our single stars, right? Mm-hmm. Whoever all wins single, all each single gauntlet, whoever wins each gauntlet match, them four then face off the following week for the a shot at the world title at the first pay per view. That's how I booked my first week show. the 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 four people that lost in each one of the gauntlet matches, you just do an eight man, two eight man battle royals. Or your United States title or whatever our mid-card title oh, is. And the winners of those two matches will then face each other at the pay-per-view for that said title. <laughs> if that confuses somebody, please let me know. <laughs> so basically, everyone got to get an opportunity. I Everybody's said, getting an opportunity. Yes. Yes, Connor. Watch mm-hmm. as we beat your son. In the middle of the ring. I think it's all fair to throw everybody. Oh God! In a match. Oh God! He heard you. Well, we're he not going to throw everybody in one gauntlet match. God, damn it! Turtles can't fly. It's going to be four four different gauntlet matches. Oh, this kid is fucking beating the shit out of me in the corner. Yeah, he heard you. I'm, I'm dead in the corner because you fucking <laughs> killed so me. The first, yeah, the, first the, month, saved me. the first month that I booked my show, everything was multi man matches. Oh, your favorite. Because you that's the that. only you way. You gotta mix it up, or else you're that's not gonna the, be a GM yeah. of the year. That's the only way you can actually do it to give everybody a fair shot. Wow. Is having multi-man matches. Raw has something to say about that. We got at least four singles matches in our <laughs> five match card. Hey, you know what? Good for fucking you. Thank Not you. <laughs> 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 so uh, 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 basement I, I, oh I, it's I, happening so that's how I've, I haven't even gone in wait and are, you, gone, are and we on the same team yeah. what, the fuck is <laughs> what is happening here <laughs> what is going on I'm like, no, it's me I'm gonna win the title match like oh, I did oh my God. the way they that fucking was did so it so stupid um, I'm sorry Helmo Farb I acted out <laughs> so I I I the one thing you do have to do in this game is look at the DMs because it'll tell you certain things. I'm sorry, man. You did because that's <laughs> so right now, <laughs> Cody. It said Cody did something in his match, and I can't remember. I think he was. Oh, you're talking about the actual title. GM mode. Yes. Okay. That no, no. No. The news section. In the universe, mode. in universe oh, mode, you can see oh, who's right. injured okay. and who's not, and you can. So what I did, oh, and I, that's I why I did so. the that's ambulance right. match the first time instead of everybody wanting to do the casket match, because oh, get him. Cody, get him, Cody gets yeah. hurt. That's where I was get going there. with Hemel, the What the fuck are you view. doing? <laughs> one more, come on, just let me get that one more, one no, more. Go there on. we go, perfect. This is... Okay, what the fuck <laughs> this shit, man? <laughs> The fuck was that? Why did I even? Why did I attack my tag team partner? <laughs> all right, this works. Yeah, all right. Fucking bullshit. Garbage. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, because both look like angry birds. Yeah. <laughs> God damn garbage. Yeah. That was garbage. <laughs> Bad. Exactly. You you agreed to be his partner. <laughs> but, you know, what was that? And Rachel, you agreed to be. What's that? Partner. That was fucking. Garbage. Fest. Listen, honestly, fight. ladder matches, DLC is terrible in this game. What? Terrible. This is you. Fucking garbage. All right, fest. I'm good for one more match, and I think the no bucks given title. Oh, oh no, uh, let's do the women's title. Heather, you're. I believe you're the champion. So. <laughs> right. <laughs> Fuck you, Rich. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Who's I talking about? <laughs> the chat. Rayshon just said Brian screwed basement. Oh, no, not oh. you. Oh, okay. These people before he got really interrupted by basement having a fucking meltdown. All right, Heather is the champion. Heather, uh, you are the champ. You want to... Oh, wait. I think Aru made a bunch of moo people. Hold on. 
beef. <laughs> um, I forget what was, what was I talking about. Cooking. What's your favorite type of meat? Chicken. Uh, you just said if anybody anybody doesn't understand what's going on. Oh yeah, if anybody doesn't understand what, how how I did that or Ooh, if they have holy questions shit. about it, feel free to please Ooh. reach out to me. I got you. I can explain it in layman's terms. I I know sometimes I get confusing when I talk, but I know what, what I want to say. What are you take. talking about? Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking beat you in about thirty seconds. What? <laughs> what? Explain what? it to me in layman's terms. So it's essentially it's gonna be. So when we get to after the gauntlet matches, those world oh, yeah. title matches, we will then spin a wheel, and those people that. You know, like they will face each other. It's it's not going to be some. It's going to be a by wheel, and it'll build feuds at some Ooh. point. That's the way. That's the way I did it. I think it'll work. Well, oh, the project. ambulance match. So at the at the at the pay per view, Cody Rhodes is having a casket match. Why? Because he's injured. He's trying to come back from so Cody Rhodes is on our roster. In my universe mode. That's that's what I'm He's doing. using it as an example as to say we need to pay attention to what the actual No, that's are. that's actually really good though. I'm and I'm also glad that they're actually, you know, fucking doing goddamn injuries in fucking universe mode because it's like, oh so and so's injured. Nothing changed. Yes. So but yeah, so the, that's that's how I am that's what's happening at a pay per view. I just gotta get him an opponent. My internet's being a bitch right now. We see. We see. <laughs> you don't say. Beat, beat it. Aru, these fucking uh, creations are goddamn okay. amazing. Who the fuck is this guy? These are custom. These are cre these are. Uh, this is part of a tag team that Haru made for uh, HD Dub. Rayshon, I made everything about you, but I didn't give you clothes, so you're just a naked man. Oh, just give him a barista yeah. apron. No, That's I fine. can't. I'm... Go back to that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He wanted a black and red getup, and I was looking for the right thing. Kane? No? That's fine. I'm, I'm always naked. <laughs> I am just Take not word understanding on that one. why you just said that. I don't know why, but my leg's bruised. <laughs> I don't understand why <laughs> you're saying that. beating the shit out of you while you sleep. <laughs> <laughs> take this and this. I, I don't know. You bumped your leg on something. Why is there you ever see, uh, what was it? Why, the why, conjuring? Why is there yeah. a Heather fist shaped bruise on my thigh every morning? Weird. No, she, be higher than that. she punched me in the balls, man. No. You Listen, punched no, her in the pussy. I, I was about to say, I was about I to did, say. I did punch her in the pussy. Payback! Poof! <laughs> Good game. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just got a punch buggy. Leg. I, I, you might be right, but I don't bump into anything. Oh, just... Weird. Maybe in your sleep, you. Nope. God, no, 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 no. They want to go in here. Fucking hell. I would kick yourself because you kicked the shit out of me in my sleep. I also want to do something else to you in your sleep. But... Go ahead. Don't wake <laughs> she, me up. She, 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 go ahead. Don't wake me up. <laughs> glove. That's going to be really fucking hard to do. <laughs> OJ Simpson 2.0 over here. Um, Heather, you are the women's well, champion. Uh, I will give you per car blanche over what type of match, what do you want to do, what type of match you want to do, who you want to face, all that stuff. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. You know what? Put me up against Murdoch, my own creation. The female A team. Oh, okay. No one-on-one -on -one match. All the A team. One-on-one -on -one match. All right. Let's see. I think I downloaded Fight it already. All the see. A team. I think I downloaded it already. Let me just see. Yep, I did. Who the fuck is this? Testing boobs. The female version of Murdoch from the A team. Oh, right. You did do that. I forgot about that. Oh, I dun, want dun, to dun. see who is Mr. T. Yes, I paid Mr. T. Way. I mean, what? Mrs. Mrs. T? What, yeah. Mrs. T, yeah. But no, uh. Miss T? <laughs> I, I can't remember what I called it, but it's definitely a woman, I think. Wait, does she have a water Pokemon with her? <laughs> oh God, you, you guys see that, like, uh, person that 
the I think she's like fucking European or something that has like super face injections. I'm like, she looks yeah, like Star she, You. <laughs> she fucking shows up on my timeline all the fucking time. No matter uh, how many bitch, times like, I knew me. everything about her. Gotta catch them all. You have to fight the entire A team. That's what you should have done. I will, one oh, at a time. Gauntlet. <gasps> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Gauntlet the A team. Oh, that's right. They actually did do a. Uh... Yeah, they actually in one of the in one of the latest a updates, you can actually customize which ring announcer you have. Basement maiden history T. No, did you did you just use beefy lips or what? No. Oh no. Oh no, he went a completely different direction with her. Yeah, her teeth are inside of her fucking face. Good job, man. Her neck's looking pretty good. Thank you. I tried to go with the same jacket he wore on the show. No, I get yeah, no, I get that, but yeah, I'm sure it was probably oh, like pretty much the same. Pretty tricky, well, I'm sure. He's got some big tits. He does. So. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Oh god, yeah, dude. I like <laughs> You're welcome for that. Which you've seen, Mr. T. With the exception of the No Bucks Given title and the HGW championship, I I personally think that the belts, the other belts, the tag, the women's and the um um, you doing a fucking luau? What the, the fuck, fuck was that? it? The tag, the women's, and the WTF. I, I think those are the best designs we've had so far. Those. Yeah, it's a solid design right there. Mhm. Mm I wish you'd wear those. Kind of clothes. Oh, wait, Casey, what I she, wrestle? She's got like regular I know, underwear I, I'm on. I'm saying to you right now, why don't you walk around the house? When, well, when Wendy's not here, I don't want you thinking. Because I don't own a pair of those pants. Why is mom walking around? You know, it, it, Amazon does two-day delivery. <laughs> People need to buy more Sensi so I can afford to buy those clothes. Amazon is such a weird name for that company. This she gets up and she's immediately wearing fucking bubble wrap and all that shit. Like, don't fucking touch me. Like, it's weird. She's weird. That's why I love her. Wait, how you switch your pants? What? Huh? What? Her whole outfit just changed. Yeah, yeah. you can you can change the outfit. outfit. It's my wrestling outfit. Right, you can do that. You can change the uh the outfit, but you wear it. Over I would have kept like the, the Hunger pants. Games. I was trying to keep the pants, but I just got so frustrated trying to find the same ones again. I have some I have some just ideas for new characters. Bitch. Bam! I want to make. I understand. Mr. T. Well, there there was an idea that I had for a, I actually had the idea for a military tag team uh, way back when, um, and I got the name from a Star Wars video game <clears throat> for what they would call them. I was going to call them the the Rogue Squadron. They're going to call them AK. Oh, can I ask you a question? When you created this character, did you create the the top yes. to look that way because yes. it, it's actually going to look like oh my god she's really she, she topless and the just a tattoo yes yeah. okay uh -huh. so, oh geez wow. you're, a, face. you're a kinky little fucking devil over here anyway btf <laughs> oh you just got kicked right in the fucking face I on did. that one that conversation quick quickly pivoted <laughs> you're a kinky little you just got punched in the face <laughs> No, but I, you know, yeah, I, see, up. I see what she's doing. She's fucking making a porno fucking of goddamn fucking the 18. Wait, wait, you see the other two? Well, which ones did you make? All of them, I made right? all three. You made Captain Papard? I didn't make him, no. I made the initial 18. I did Doc, Murdoch, and T. Yeah, no, Basement did T. Oh, no, Basement did T, yeah. I did face. Then you need to do Captain Papard. <coughs> you, Captain you can do it. I, I do, dude, dude. Just don't, no. I, you, you volunteered. You volunteered. Like hey. I didn't. Well, I no. Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't volunteer anything. I said, why didn't you make? I forgot he existed. I was focusing on just the A team, the four <laughs> members of the A team. I know what you were focusing on. Oh, Heather's made a comeback. She's been here for years. Oh, nope. Never mind. Oh, God, Murdoch's tits. <laughs> Bam. 
Beefy Lips is eyeing with both those fucked up eyes that women's championship. That's, <laughs> I'll be honest with you. That, that's kind of a nice, like, there, you know, there's little things that they do in this game. Like I've talked about before where, like, there's little tiny attentions to detail that they do that I that I really appreciate. And one of the ones I would love they would be able to do is if you did, like, a thing where, like, somebody's, like, an enemy of yours is watching in the crowd. Oh, that'd be great. And then you and can do like do that music hitting and them standing yep. in the room. And then you can, and you can, well, no, not even like, uh, like, uh, right. Like no entrance or music or anything like that. They're just like in the front row, almost like the akin to like a manager. Right. And then when yeah. you go, when you go up to them, you have like, I don't know, like one of three actions you can do. Like either they hit you, you hit them or whatever the fuck. Um, I think that could be a lot of fun. Whoop. It would be, but we see how bad these games act with the minimal. But that's why I want to see it because I want to see it get fucked up and get ruined. <laughs> glitched out. How short can you go in this game? Five foot even. Can you do five foot and four hundred? I don't know what your logic. You could go you five foot. Five hundred well, pounds. That's what I'm fucking talking about. That's what I want to fucking see. That's why I did May Resterio. He wants to see the opposite. <laughs> Tall as hell and skinny. Seven fucking twelve no. inch. I want short, to, as, short as fuck and oh. fat as fuck. We can play with that real quick before we wrap up the street. Oh, maybe I'm not. I'm fucking yeah, dying. Dude, you want to get me fucking laughing like a fucking? <laughs> oh, I think Heather's about to retain. So, up oh, and well, the first of the A team. A. That's got to be it. One, two. Oh, wow. Not, it's not even fucking Wait, touched. Look at the crowd. They're Ooh, fucking doing shit. this. Hey, listen, they fucking all looked over to the left earlier for no fucking reason. So <laughs> well, I don't yeah, trust at their least shit. they're watching the match. That's true. I think we're in a game. I mean, the game to me, I don't look at the little things. But I the well, things look at the that crashes that have the, happened twice. So yes, and I know a lot of the things, once, actually. a lot of good things that I see from the game is the crowd. At time, I know pretty soon you're going to start seeing the entire crowd swaying. I, this game's not perfect, as you just saw from the game crashing earlier, and that that shit will eventually get fixed. I, I know that usually the crashes early on have to do with a lot of like custom and creation shit, so I'm I'm not like sweating it. I will say this though, in all sincerity, that despite the flaws of this game. It's definitely a step in the right direction from last year's. Um, you know, it's obviously a lot of the same, but oh god, I fucking just booted you in the face! Oh, could have a new champ cover. One, two. Oh, okay, I got a little nervous there. Oh. And these these near falls are fucking much better. Oh, and also, also, what's really cool about this next year is you will not see the little meters. Waha! You mean like this? Yeah. Yeah, but turn that shit off during universe mode, which is good. It's going to take some getting used niche. to, especially when it gets to, like, you know, multi Which will add to the drama of what's happening. Mm -hmm. Oh. I like the idea that oh. we don't get to see the, uh... It just adds the, the um, impact to each wrestler. Yep. Yeah. So, what I've noticed that it does do certain things, it does a lot more, um... Yeah, it's a drama. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, the game, the game. Also, it's a better off, presentation. It doesn't. It will it, do. It, it, yes, it will it's a game, do, but it looks more like the real thing. Mm -hmm. It will do false finishes. Uh oh. Well, it, I was about to say it's doing false finishes a lot better than like that. I honestly wish that should have been three. I wish this game inter instead of doing like just free cam. Uh oh. I wish it did what Red Dead Redemption did, and give you like hit a button, change the actual camera angle. Yeah, just to it a does. predetermined other camera angle. It does. You like, uh, it gives you no, such no, a limited without option. To, without going to free mode, can you do like yeah, a here you swap see. between so four see, camera you angles? Can do like, it's, instead of like stage south. Um, hold on. Can yeah. you do it without pulling up the fucking thing? Hold on. Memorize the buttons. I'm trying to. <laughs> Give me a second. Give me one so yeah, second. if if it if it allows you to like change the camera angles without pulling up the fucking glossary. No, what the fuck was that? What did you? Should there you go. Up, uh... Well, that kind of sort of, kind of sort of. Let's very, see, but 
It's very loose. Is this where oh, I feel like... like... What I... Did you just do all that, Connor? Yeah, that was yes. me. Yeah. This is where I feel like less is more. If if they allowed you to watch a match and gave you the square oh, shape oh, no, 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 as I'm different done. angles... There we go. That's what I was looking for. You can stop now, Kevin Dunn. Nope. Jeez. I'm trying to get the right one. There we go. That's what I wanted. And just in time. I, I think oh, shit. I, I, so what I think is there's oh, too many me. options for camera angles. I think one of the best windows like matches we've angle... ever done in HG Dub. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like the camera angle changes should be only like three different ones. I also think it should be a little more natural. But... Can this be the end? Is that your finisher? Yes. Can this be the end? I'm not controlling the match. There we go. Oh, thank fucking Christ. Heather. Anyway, Congrats Heather on the title retain, Heather. Congratulations. Fist bump, fist bump on that shit. She even fucking asked for her challenger. So how are you a heel now? And she, she's she, a heel. Yeah. She's doing this as she's walking down the fucking room. I didn't nope. do anything with the entrance. Yeah. I just made her and put she's it in. Shooing, she's shooing the fans, you know, don't cheer for me, <laughs> you fucking She entrance. also could be farting. I mean, you want to uh, see an entrance, JP, you got to watch Cum Bucket or whatever the fuck his name is. Oh, God, Bum right, Chuck it or whatever. I am going that's, to that's go to bed. We're, we're all wrapping up here, Ray Sean, so it's all good. But you have a good night, good sir. And uh, all you guys for uh, checking things out here. Much appreciated. Sorry for the uh, the crash earlier but uh good times by all uh we'll be back wednesday with what i don't even know what we're doing yeah fuck yeah we finally beat a game (laughs) yeah you guys finally beat the game yeah Yeah, we we did tiny tiny tennis so what happens at the end of that game the horse comes back right after basement fucking calls it the horse gets rebirthed and you go back to bright foot and everybody sucks your dick yep. yep pretty much anyway guys tune in subscribe like share comment all that stuff we're gonna wrap this up thank you all for tuning in appreciate it uh, until next time peace out we'll make that weird guy that oh, you I want to be